Hi Capricorn, welcome to Heaven Healing and Tarot. This is Christina. Today we're going to be getting you some messages. Let's see what's going on in your energy and what your angels and guides might want to tell you at this time. Before I get started, I always send out some healing. So take a deep breath with me. You ready? All right, Capricorn, let's get your cards. Ace of Wands, King of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, Page of Swords, Six of Cups. Well, Cat, look at this. Looks like uh, you got some feelings for somebody. At least you're desiring somebody pretty strongly. Maybe somebody from your past or somebody you knew from uh, childhood. Somebody's caught your attention. You want to come in with a fiery offer. <laughs> uh, yeah, you want to come in and offer you uh, a good time to somebody. You're feeling it. You are feeling it. Um, I, I think you might be successful because you're the king of pentacles and then everything he touches turns to gold. So you just might be um, in for a nice time in the next, you know, week or so. Page of Swords is learning something, learning something new. So uh, you could be keeping an eye on somebody or somebody could be keeping their eye on you. And like I said, Six of Cups is somebody from the past. So it doesn't have to be a toxic ex, but it, it could be just somebody you used to know. Um, but yeah, I think somebody has definitely um, stirred up some um, heat within you. <laughs> some desire. Let's get some more cards. The Hangman, Nine of Swords, Two of Cups, Four of Pentacles. All right. So somebody's got your, grabbed your attention, right? But now you're in your head. You're in your head about it. Like you're having some anxiety over it. Uh, is this a soulmate? Could be. Two of Cups is here. Could be a soulmate, so now you're worried um, that you might want more than just uh, a romp. You know, you might you might want more. You might you might have feelings that scares you a little bit that those feelings won't be reciprocated. Hmm. You're holding on to something way too tightly, though. You got to let go of something. So if you're hoping for more than just a roll in the hay, um, you know, don't, don't be too forceful with, with it. Try to see things from every angle, all perspectives, right? But I have a feeling that your sacrifices are going to pay off. So I think you just have to play your cards right with this one for some reason. I'm feeling like you got to play the game. I think this might turn into something because I do think that you guys are soulmates. But I think it's going to start off with, uh, you know, friends with benefits here. Let's see. Let's see what else we get. See if I'm right. See if it could be something more. Or if you're going to get your heart broken. <laughs> I hope not. I hope not, Capricorn. I hope not. Honoring your true feelings. Okay, so this is you coming to realize that you actually have feelings for this person, that it's more than just a roll and a hay for you, and you honoring that and uh, maybe doing something about it. Huh? It's a good thing. Your life is a canvas. Manifestation. Creative accountability. Okay, so you are manifesting something amazing here. Maybe it's more than just a... Uh, a good time maybe you are manifesting love here um, but get creative about it be smart be wise get creative think outside the box
listen to your heart awakening psychic abilities tune into the infinite yeah listen to your heart what does your heart want does your heart want more if your heart wants more maybe you need to do something about that all right maybe you need to get creative and find a way to make this person fall for you just as much as you're falling for them such a curious dream yeah you're you're you caught feelings <laughs> you're catching feelings if you haven't you will um it looks like you're catching feelings for somebody and it, you might think it's just a um you know a temporary thing and i don't i don't think it's going to be temporary i don't think you're going to be able to get this person out of your head i think you're going to dream about them i think you're going to fantasize i think you're going to be thinking about them a lot but you can't block them by holding on to them too tightly. You got to kind of keep a loose grip on this one. At least, you know, you, you, you can't hold too tightly. You can't. I think you'll push them away if you do that. So like I said, get creative. But hold your vision. When you hold your vision, you'll get what you want. That's always a great card. Hold your vision. Because that that's that leads you to have hope, right? Hold if you hold your vision, you can have exactly what you want. Like don't give up now. It's like don't give up before you uh, win the race. Keep going. Oh, look at that. This could lead to marriage. This situation could lead to marriage. Wow, did not expect that. Always I only thought this was like a, you know, a fun time. But somebody. <laughs> it's going to lead to marriage. Look at that. Whew, this went a lot faster than I thought. Okay, Cap. If you could do anything, what would it be? The answer dwells in your heart, not in your mind. For the heart is the gateway to the soul. So, this is saying you need to follow your heart. You got to get out of your head or, you know, don't, don't listen to just, uh, you know, parts that should not be controlling you. <laughs> Now, if you have desire for somebody, that's great. Um, but I, I think you need to listen to your heart. If your heart is saying that there's something more here, then you need to try and um, at least try to get that. At least try for it to be something more than just sex or sex, uh, good time, you know? Um, because it could be an amazing relationship. You are soulmates. There is soulmate energy here, and it could lead to marriage. So... Honor your, honor your feelings. Go for what your heart desires. What is it that you truly want? Get it out of your head saying, no, I've been there, done that. I don't want to do that again. Or, or you know, whatever that negative thoughts are. Um, follow your heart because I don't think that you can get this. This person is under your skin. I don't think you're going to be able to get them. Um, you're going to stop thinking about them or let them go. I think you're going to need them. I think you're going to need them in your life. For all those cross watchers, Capricorn, your, go get your Capricorn. <laughs> go let your Capricorn know how you feel. Dakini of Infinite Light, number nine. All right, let's read from the book. Why do I always go past them? Number nine. Here we go. Seek and you shall find. Find the teacher and teachings which feel pure to your heart. But remember, it is the inner truth of you that will ultimately set you free. Do not give your power away, but do trust in a greater guiding wisdom at work in all aspects of your life. 
Ask for help from the enlightened spiritual beings in any matter of concern, and help shall be granted. So ask your angels, right? Believe all problems can be resolved and a more graceful life experience is opening up for you. Believe a more graceful life is opening up for you. So it's not going to be just sex. It is going to be more than that. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm excited for you. I don't know if that's what you want or what you wanted to hear, but I'm excited for you. Let's pull you some more charms. Here we go. Luck is on your side, Capricorn. Yep, definitely. The wheel is turning in your favor. You're you're going to fall in love. This is the right direction for you. Don't fight it. Right? You're going to see things clearly. Luck is on your side. Some more. There's definitely love here. Love and love. You're going in the right direction still. You're going to be tying the knot. Look at that. Tying the knot. You guys are going to, this relationship's going to bloom and blossom and grow into something absolutely beautiful. It's magical. With the fairy, it's magical. There's the crown. So put on your crown. Be the king that you are. Go after what your heart desires. Don't let anybody talk you out of it. Okay, it's meant for you. Be the star. Shine bright. Don't be scared. There you got my little hedgehog. Hedgehogs go crawl up in a ball, right, when they're scared. Don't be that hedgehog. Don't get scared. Be brave. Go, go after this. And then finally you got the monkey. That's somebody, this is somebody you could take care of. Somebody that you could be a real, you know, partner for. Somebody that you could like groom. <laughs> you know, you get to, 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 to be like, I don't know, very loving and caring towards each other. Cap. Wow, this started out as a friends with benefits situation and turned into a like, a love match and happily ever after getting married <laughs> didn't see this one coming but wow 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 all right good for you i like this but that's what i got for you so you know give the video a like subscribe to the channel and uh leave me a comment all those things help me and and i appreciate you for that until next time love and light